So we have the pigtail in the left ventricle and we are pulling it back across the aortic valve. So you're gonna read an LV pressure and then you're gonna read an aortic pressure. And what you're looking at is to evaluate if there's a gradient between the two and systole, that's when the aortic valve opens. So you're in the left ventricle, you record that pressure. Then you see a moment you pull back across the aortic valve and the pressure changes to an aortic waveform like you have here. Now this one, there is no gradient between the two. So this patient does not have aortic stenosis by waveform measurement. So take the second example where we're in the left ventricle, again, recording a pressure, pull back across the aortic valve, you see this change. And what you'll notice is there is a systolic gradient where you have that drop in pressure. And not only that, this indicates aortic stenosis, but you also have what we call pulsus tardis, where you have this waveform that loses the dichrotic notch and the pressure is a little damped when it is in the aorta.